It's a frosty morning, it's half past seven, and I'm just about to make us all some breakfast for the day. Whoa, my hair is like crazy today. Good morning guys, I thought I would start today's vlog. If you can hear any noise, Elliot's just in the playroom watching the snowy day, which he really, really likes at the moment. Anyway, I digress already. That's not a good start, is it? We've had quite a busy like time at the moment. So it's just a day at home today. It's really exciting because this vlog is actually in collaboration with Jakes of London. We are working with them on today's video. Um, they have sent Elliot and Jasper Jasper's a little bit young but he'll play with them eventually hopefully some new toys to play with so if you're new around here I'm a mum of two little boys Elliot is 18 months old and my baby Jasper is four months old so we've been sent some lovely new toys to try out so this is going to be like a little unboxing and first impressions of their toys in today's video um, they arrived just now so we're going to unbox them in a, little, in a little bit once Elliot's done watching the snowy day if you don't know about Jakes of London they are are a family run toy company that invent and create toys in going for over 200 years which is crazy when jakes asked to work with us i was quite excited because you might already know if you watch my vlogs like my toddler elliot like he's not always like that into toys so i'm always looking for new toys that are going to spark his interest that he might actually like a lot and play with he is the sort of child that really likes kind of role play type of toys so he likes his kitchen he likes sorting he likes um, sort of baskets boxes that kind of thing so one of the toys I've picked I thought would be quite good for him because it's like a toy shape sorter type it's like an activity hey, cube hey darling yeah we're gonna open it in a minute one minute and then another is like a little magnetic truck so yeah I'll show you those right now and I'm gonna let you know how Elliot gets on with them so here we have our packages as i mentioned elliot will always turn a box into something exciting so we've got off to a good start today already when we unbox these items together because he's having a bit of a clamber on the box i did get him off promptly but um yeah he does love a good box and as you can see these toys come in such lovely packaging on the box itself it actually displays images of the family behind the company so like the jakes of london family it's also got pictures of some of the toys that they've invented. They're actually the oldest toy company in the world. And um, you'll be surprised at some of the games that they've invented. I will leave a link to their website down below, so check that out. It really adds a bit of a personal touch to see some of the founders behind the brand and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, the first toy that we're opening is a wooden activity cube. I picked this because I thought it'd be perfect for Elliot because he likes boxes so much as I've said and I thought that he could sort through this and I had high hopes that it would spark his interest and he got straight in there got the cube out the box and he was basically just away with it straight away and um, the little blocks that the number blocks inside came in this little plastic pouch so I got them all out for him and I just scattered them on the floor and basically left him to it because I think it's really important to let children have some good independent play because it lets them learn to play creatively and use their imagination so this sort of toy is really good at developing problem solving skills he was already moving the brightly colored beads along sort of wind around so he was having a good go with that quite a bit and then he was just basically exploring where to put the blocks they do have numbers on them so it's good for like number skills eventually and also on the opposite side was animals Once he'd had an actual play with it, then he ended up putting it back in the box. I'm not lying when I said that he likes boxes.
And the second toy that we've picked is a magnetic crane truck. Now I thought something like this would be good for Elliot's like coordination, um, also like just a good imaginative toy for him to play with. He has started in playing recently like with little cars and trucks so I thought that this would be quite a good one. And so as you can see he's just like moving it backwards and forwards and just seeing how it works really. So he sat here with all the toys together and just playing with them to his little heart's content. I really do enjoy watching children play and just watching them discover how to use things and how their little minds work really. It's really good for their imaginative skills. And then little Jasper woke up from his nap and he had a bit of a go with the activity cube. Obviously everything goes in their mouth at this age still, um, but he was sort of gripping onto that. It's also going to teach them how to share eventually. <laughs> I was actually really impressed by the quality of these toys because sometimes online when you see wooden toys you don't know what they're gonna what sort of quality they're gonna be and especially the price point of these toys is amazing and the quality just feels so so good um, here I am just putting some of the numbers in a little row for the boys to have a look at and then Elliot is tipping the activity cube upside down just having a good play with it really um, I was so impressed to see him play for hours with this because he's not really one for toys so it was really pleasing actually to see him enjoying it for a change but hopefully now he's getting a little bit older he will be more interested in toys so yeah I'm just gonna run some clips now of him playing with the toys um, they are so beautiful there's also the branding on the toys and they're just really really nice quality for the price point and another thing with wooden toys is they're gonna last like they stand the test of time don't they um, and there's loads of toys on there that are sort of gender neutral Obviously I've got this magnetic crane truck which you could argue is like more leaning towards a boys toy but I do have two boys but the activity cube could be for girls or boys um, so yeah they are really gorgeous quality toys beautiful packaging good price point I was so so impressed and it was just lovely to see both the boys actually playing with them really. Them. Are they down your top? Should we get them out? Hopefully that's given you a nice little glimpse at some of the beautiful toys we've picked up. They are such nice quality. Thank you again Jakes of London for working with us on this video and I would highly recommend having a look at their website because they would make some beautiful affordable toys for children in your family, your own children, nieces, nephews, friends. I think now we are going to probably make some lunch soon and Oliver will probably be home in a little bit. Lunch time. A lot of it's gone on the floor though. A bit later on now, it's actually the evening. I've just been cooking dinner. Um, we, ha we are having a chicken korma coconut style curry. Even though it's a weekday, just fancy curry, something like nice and warming on a cold winter's day. Elliot has been playing with his wooden activity cube as I've been cooking dinner this evening which has been really nice because sometimes when I'm cooking and in the evenings they can get a little bit they can go downhill children when it's like when they're getting tired so it's been nice that he's been occupied with something for a change because he doesn't always play that well at this time of day so he obviously has been enjoying his new toys have our dinner in a bit it's literally dinner time any minute now Mm. 
Probably end up finishing this vlog now. Watching, and I'll see you again really soon. Bye.